Welcome back, my fellow Final Fanians, to more Let's Play Final Fantasy X-2. And in our last episode, we finally finished all the side bullshit. Um, do we? Was that last? God, I've lo I've lost. I haven't recorded this in in a few days, so I don't remember. The, I don't remember exactly what I did last episode, but I know I found Topoli and all that other nonsense, and finished the rest of the Com Spheres. Pretty much pulled my hair out, but. Finally, this episode, and probably the next, or should I say, either this episode or the next one, we will finish this chapter off, because it's pretty much closing in on the end. But, uh, we are in the Thunder Plains getting ready for Yuna's concert. And before we can do the concert, we have to dispose of that horrible fiend, which is stalking, uh, all the people waiting to see the concert. Yeah. Because... You know, the fiend is hungry and he wants to eat people. So we must dispose of them before concerts. Like, Jesus, can we get a break? We gotta dispose of fiends, we gotta sing for everybody, we gotta do everything. It's craziness. Get out of my way. Okay, and this is basically the cave. The hidden cave in the Thunder Plains, which we never were had access to in Final Fantasy X. Ooh. We have a new enemy encounter. All right. Kill them all. Uh oh. I don't like this sleep stuff. I don't like this sleep stuff. Kill them all. Sorry, I got distracted. My cat knocked something down. I don't appreciate it. Look, I'm not even paying attention to the battle. I'll just keep pressing the X button. I'm like attacking left and right. Did anyone learn anything? No. Oh boy. Okay. Continuing on. Damn it. The encounter rate is ridiculous. Oh boy. Um, yeah. These guys are harder than uh, bosses, so I'm not dealing with them. And what the hell's wrong with Pain? She didn't even run away. She. Ah, oh, she's stoned. I'm sorry. I should pay more attention to you, huh? Anyways, over here is another battle. Kill them all. Why am I hitting like a wimp? There you go. Uh, Riku should be learning um, very useful ability soon. I don't know what's taking her so long. Oops. Let's see. Oh, she already learned it. Okay, I wasn't paying attention. Items level 2. Cuts the time required to use items by 80%. Very nice. And now she's learning Chemist, which is great. Which uh, doubles the potency. So I think when we combine... Um, our high potions will heal for 4,000 instead of the typical 2,000, which is awesome. Oh, come on. You're going to attack me in the middle of climbing this guy again. No. Damn. You ain't messing around, are you? Jesus Christ, man. Don't be afraid to use Riku's heals. Magic is not going to be that useful in this... Uh, next fight, so it's not that big of a deal. Uh, there is an X potion over there in the right, but I think we'll get it on our way back, so don't worry about it. Just, yeah, actually, we could get it right now. Bring it, punk. Oh, no, not oversold, no! Damn it, I'm too late, he oversold. That thing is annoying. I think someone mentioned in my comments that the oversoul ability... Happens when I run from battles too much, the enemies tend to oversold themselves. I don't know if that's true or not. Maybe someone can verify it for me? I don't know. Anyways, give me my treasure. I damn it! <laughs> Ooh, a new enemy encounter. The Gigas and the Flan. Uh, I'm guessing that thing casts fire. Now, in Final Fantasy X, these things would be actually intimidating, but, um... I'm not really intimidated, because this is X-2. 
Only certain monsters are intimidating, like the one that brings me to one health. But these things are a joke. I know. I agree, Yuna, that's it. That was pathetic. Aha, here's the other treasure we want with the next potion. Oh no, elixir. Maybe the next potion is down there. That's weird. I could have sworn it was the next potion. Whatever. I don't want to fight this guy. Let's heal up. Alright folks, this is the boss fight. Our first boss fight in what seems like forever, my god. Bring it, Biatch. Isn't this cute? Okay, what do we? What do you say? We show them how it's done. First thing is first. Let's let's boost her uh, her magic. What the hell was that? That he just one shot her. That's ridiculous. Yeah, that's fair. Oh my god! This battle is up to a, a great start, isn't it? Ice Brand. This guy is immune to power break and all the other breaks, so... Woo! A nice timing, Riku. Let's do another one. There you go, Ice Brand attacks for 1600. Let's try. Uh, not yet. So we're doing some decent damage. It's funny because I remember my first playthrough of this game, um, before I knew about all the 100% and all that other nonsense. You know, when the game was actually released and I first played it. I never really did all the side stuff and everything. If you don't do the side stuff, as you can imagine... Oh, he's dead. <laughs> that was easy. If you don't do the side stuff, as you can imagine, um, you pretty much are weak as hell when you get to this point. And I remember that boss tearing me a new one. So... I'm glad I leveled. We got the Crimson Ring and the Black Ring. Let's check them out. I forgot what they do. The Crimson Ring and the Black Ring. Black Ring nullifies gravity, okay. Maybe it'll be useful. Crimson Ring converts fire damage to HP, that's nice. So if we ever run into another uh, creature that does fire damage, we can nullify it and actually he'll be healing us, which is great. Alright, that's it for this cave, let's get the hell out of here. We cleared the monster. And now we can go sing! Yeah! How do we get out of here? Goings at your service! Uh, you guys and your stupid poisons. Just die. There. You know, you would figure after a boss encounter that they would eliminate the enemies from this stupid place, but no. They'd rather be assholes to us. Jeez. The counter rate's a little ridiculous, don't you think? All I'm trying to do is get out of here. They keep attacking me. All right, please tell me I can go this way. <sighs> Jesus.
one good thing is once this chapter is done, we're really starting now. Chapter 5 is really not that bad. It's actually pretty entertaining. There's a lot of uh, story stuff and all that with it. A lot of... They call it the chapter complete section, which is we go to each place in the game. Pretty much they have a little story and all that, you know, like... As you can imagine with Poseid, obviously Rik, uh, Lulu's gonna have her baby and all that. And, you know, just all pretty good story stuff, believe it or not, for Chapter 5. So, in my opinion, Chapter 5 is my favorite chapter in the entire game, which we're heading into. Very soon, I think our next episode will be the final episode of uh, Chapter 4, and then we will be starting on Chapter 5, so I'm excited. Get me out of the stupid cave. Come on. Oh, one more battle before escaping. I think I'm going to go for a nice three mile uh, jog today. It's been a while. Got a. I've been eating kind of healthy, you know. I'm in a nice little diet. Nothing crazy. Just trying to, you know, stay healthy because my dad and all of them have a ten. Uh, history of diabetes and all that and I just want to stay away from that and I've been doing good what the hell we're landing if we cram any more people on board this thing is gonna fall out of the sky yay mission complete What do you say we talk to everyone? This is pretty cool. You're in their airship, and we're obviously in the Thunder Plane still, so it's kind of dark inside, and I really I really like that. I think hey, that's neat. We brought in people from the Yevon and the Youth League. They're all outside on the concert grounds. You serious, man? Yon, now it is all up to you. Just keep talking to everybody the here. Audience behaves long enough to listen. Until there's no more voice acting attached, basically. Or until you see the square box. One thing worries me. The two groups are already locking horns. With their leaders gone and everything, the people are just a little bit edgy. Be alright. I hope it doesn't get violent out there. Yeah, yeah. Sphere screen calibration complete. We can start any time. Hey, uh... The crowd is acting kind of funny. Let me pull the video up. What's going on up there? Uh oh, this could get messy. No kidding. The two groups have been bumping heads since they got on the airship. Yeah. Looks like they're itching to start something. I'll pick up the audio. The Yevonites are here too? How am I supposed to enjoy the concert with them stinking up the air? Hey, you youth league dogs will never be worthy of hearing the high summoner sing. If the traitor were here, he'd never let these maggots walk around spouting their nonsense. What I want to know is, where'd Nuge go? It's his fault that Spear is falling apart. What kind of leader abandons his people when they need him most? A jerk. Don't they ever stop? Nope. Seriously. Nope. Well, Yuna, you're the one who wanted to do something. Nope. Yeah, but... Nope. <laughs> Alright, let me stop. So let's do something. Right! Let's do it! Yeah! Dobly! Oh, just dropped a catastrophe! Dear me, dear me! What a whatever should I do? The spectators are making a spectacle! I don't even want to speculate! Please, do something, Yuna! Leave it to us! Yeah!
Okay, don't talk to Tobley just yet. I want to che check some stuff out back here. Well, I'll tell you what. What we're going to do is... We're going to stop the episode here. Next time, we will finish up Chapter 4. And see you in this beautiful concert. <laughs> so, we'll see you guys next time to finish off Chapter 4. Quick little chapter, huh? Not too bad. What was it, like six episodes or something like that? Whatever. See you guys next time for more fun. Did we get any percentage points? Did we? Did we? I am obsessed with percentage. Let's see. 72%. Yeah, biatch. See you guys next time. Peace.